guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Jody, and I am so glad that you could join me today. Now that the carpet is all done, I am so ready to get this house back in order. As you can see, I have some bookcases here behind me. I am in my husband's office, and I am getting ready to redo them. So, let's get to decorating. Okay, so I did get the top of the bookcases done. I wasn't going to put this on the camera of me doing this as I've been going up and down the step ladder many times. I might do the on-camera decorating for the individual bookcases, but we'll wait and see. It is going to be a little time-consuming trying to figure out all these books. So I'm going to give you a little bit closer-up view here in just a second. Okay, so I put some of this stuff on there. And my husband likes the old world. I mean, I do too. But uh, he likes to have golden brown in his office. So that's what I'm doing for him. And the little thing with the garden ball is new that I put on here. Everything else is the same. I just uh, redid it. And now I'm going to get ready to do one of the bookcases. Okay, so I started putting some books on, and I uh, got a couple items on the shelves here. Now I'm going to find some more things that I have over to the side. I'm going to set those there. The greenery's on the floor here. small wedding pictures right there. And set that there. Some more greenery. I just like to use ferns in his room. Okay, set that like so. And we got that going there now. Just want to play with your greenery to move around. I just really want everything showing. I cover up a few things. There's a bad spot on that. So I think I'm liking that pretty much. And uh, might do some more tweaking later after I do the other side, but uh, we'll keep it this way for now. So let's head over to the other side. Okay, so now I'm going to do the right side of the bookcases. I, again, have some books set up already and a few items. So now I'm just going to add a few more. And his room is the one room I've never decorated with a chicken, but it's getting one. This one's a more Tuscany style to it, which I think will blend in. I think we'll just put some greenery around them. Like so. I think that looks good that way. Let's see. A couple more items. On the top shelf. And let's put one of these right there. Grab some more greenery. camera. It's made out of resin. It looks like one though. Set that there. Grab more greenery. I think that's all I'm going to put on this shelf. And I think that will do it for the shelf. So I always like to add a little bit of greenery, get a little more color. Because everything's so dark in here. Do a little bit more tweaking on it. 
Okay, so I think I like the way this side is looking. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do in the middle yet. The upper part of the middle over here. Move this a little bit. I have a few things sitting here that I might put right there. But the upper part, I don't do anything up there but a bunch of his books. And the lower part doesn't really get decorated either. Down here. I got this section done. And I added this candle and candlestick. And I have another smaller one that I put on the top shelf over there by the chicken. And if you remember, this was on the very top. I brought it down to have some more light color down here, and the other piece that resembles that one is up on top, which I will show you everything once I get all the books into the glass door area. Here's how they turned out. And I did change the thing up there by the metal airplane. That was that lighter colored one with a garden ball on it, and I moved that one up in its place. And I think this turned out pretty well. Uh, over in this corner here, I'm going to add a couple of trunks that I had in the master bedroom and the tall candlesticks. So I'm going to go down stairs and grab those and we will get this corner finished. I brought the two trunks up. These were in the master bedroom over by the tall dresser. And I had these sitting there with it too in the master bedroom, so I thought I'd put these in here. Something kind of like that, maybe. Okay, and then I just want to add a little bit of greenery over here. This is such a bare corner, and it's not really big enough to put a chair in, so I thought these would look perfect. And I actually had this sitting, oops, on it too. So, I'm probably going to have to tweak the fern real quick. Okay, I think I like that better. So, that's this corner. And there are a few things there. So now, there is just uh, one more little area, and it's the top of the filing cabinet. I'm just going to cut, set a couple of things on top of there. Okay, so this is the last little area that I did. This uh, small lamp I put on top of this little box, added some greenery, and just another decorative box behind it. So that will do it for the decorate in here, and let me show you a view of the whole thing. And I have the trunk, the two trunks there, stacked. And just wanted to let you guys know that no matter what I try in here, overhead light, or just having the blinds open, still looks really yellow but this right here um, this wall right here is what it looks like so just kind of ignore all the yellowness on here because it's not yellow okay and sorry for the glare I'm gonna try to I'm gonna go shut the blinds and pan over there it might be a little dark though so I've turned the light on Okay, so I shut the blinds and turned all the lights on and still not looking the way it looks in person. It's not that bright uh, yellow glare in that corner. It's a nice uh, soothing gold color. This is how it turned out on this wall. Okay, let's get a little close up here. All the stuff. And like I said, up here is just books. Down here. Okay. Okay, and then we're just going to pan around on the other side. However, in this area is his desk, which I'm not going to touch. I let him do whatever he wants to on his desk. But I am going to get some kind of curtains in here. I still haven't found anything that I like. It's been a little over three years, still can't find anything. And I really want to put something on this wall here. I don't know what to put. It's, with his monitors right here, it has to be something really small. So I'm not sure what to do on that. If anybody has any ideas, I would love to hear them. And then over here 
is just the wall. A little section of wall before you head out to the left to go out the to the hallway. And we just have this picture here because you can't really put any furniture down here because it blocks the walkway. Well, that will do it for my video. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate a like. And if you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe. So wishing everybody a very wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.